Root is a traditional parsad that is offered to Lord Hanuman, especially when we do Hanuman Puja. In a bowl, here I have some flour. In a mug, here I have some stay fresh milk. To this, I have already added some distinction evaporated milk. Also, now I'm going to add some fresh harvest condensed milk. To my flour, I'm going to add some gold medal ghee. Also to my milk mixture, I'm going to add some sugar, some fresh harvest granulated sugar. For this, I'm not going to use a spoon. I'm going to use my hand, my fingers. I want to tell you I washed my hand before. So, I'm going to incorporate the ghee into the flour gently like so. And the kitchen smells divine as the flour patch on the stove. To my flour and ghee, I'm going to add some cardamom. And to this, now I'm gently going to pour in the milk mixture. I'm going to make this into a soft dough, soft enough that it will hold together. Now I'm going to use this dough and make it into little balls, or loyas, as we call them here in Trinidad. Everybody has their different, unique way of preparing roll. Some people like to take their banana or their rolling pin and roll the, the dough, but I like to squeeze them between the palms. I like when the ends are jagged and when it fries, the edges become crispy. And so, I'm not sure if you know, but the road is made around symbolic of the sun. And the sun happens to be the guru of Lord Hanuman. And whenever we look at the depiction of the sun, the sun is always round in shape. But if you were to ask anybody to draw a diagram of the sun, they will always draw the sun with jagged edges. Hence the reason why I like to squeeze it between my palm, creating these jagged edges resembling the sun sole. I've already placed some ghee to heat in a pan. And now I'm gonna have add my roach dough. That I squeeze between my palms.
After a few minutes, I'm now turning this beautiful looking rose. You can fry them to whatever color you choose to. But I like them when they're golden brown and crisp. Now that our load is finished, I'm going to take them out from the heat and I'm going to put them on a paper towel to drain them. 